Hi, I'm Tim Robertson at Metro Toyota here in Kalamazoo, Michigan. And we thought we'd show how to connect your iPhone to, in this case, a RAV4 with Apple CarPlay. But we're gonna also connect it via Bluetooth. And the reason that you wanna do Bluetooth as well as an Apple CarPlay is real simple. Cables go bad. So if you're driving and your cable goes bad, well, you default to a Bluetooth connection on your iPhone to your vehicle. So to set up Bluetooth in your uh, Entune 3.0 system in a Toyota, you go to Menu, you go to Setup, then we're going to go to Bluetooth. Now, nothing's been registered, so you just say yes, and it will start looking for a phone. In this case, it's going to look for my, te my telephone. That's Tim's iPhone 8 Plus. I'm gonna click that. I'm also clicking it on my phone and telling my phone to pair with it. I'm going to allow this vehicle to have access to my contacts. I've already got the Entune 3.0 app loaded on my phone. If I didn't, it would ask to download it. And my phone is now connected. So to connect your phone to any Toyota that has Apple CarPlay, number one, you have to have a lightning cable, plug it into your phone, and you have to plug in the USB to this port. You plug your phone in. It's always going to ask the first time you plug in your own, your iPhone, can this vehicle and this iPhone talk to each other? And I'm going to say always enable. Now my phone is also going to ask, can I enable this as well? And I say allow the phone to work. Now it's immediately going to start playing any music or any podcast or anything like that that you previously had playing. But once you're installed, it's really easy to see all the enabled apps on your phone that works with Apple CarPlay. This button brings up Siri. Siri, to take me to Metro Toyota. Getting directions to Metro Toyota. Make sure you come visit us at Metro Toyota. We'd love to show you this in person and some of our Toyotas in stock right now.